Well, the orders just kept on coming in downtown Norfolk. Today was the first day for food truck vendors to set up during the lunch rush. But the big question is, will there be enough curb appeal to keep them? Ten of your sides, Walter Hildebrand serves up the story. Hey, how y'all doing today? The day has finally come. Did I get the classic chicken? Food trucks and food carts hit the roads in Norfolk today. Tacos and one pork and pineapple. And for vendors like Evan Harrell, this day has been a long time coming. I-22, Granby Bistro. Earlier this month, he and a handful of others won a lottery to sell their wares downtown, but it may be the city of Norfolk that's the big winner here. And the idea with the food trucks is to bring more people into downtown Norfolk. Hopefully they'll get on the tide and just ride right down, you know, it's MacArthur Square. The people who work down here, we're going to get more options of quick, good, delicious food to eat. And so far, these Meals on Wheels have gotten positive reviews with the downtown lunch crowd. Dave McDonald got the chicken taco. I think it's great. I think it's wonderful that we have the choices now downtown, somewhere that's fast, somewhere that's easy, and somewhere like the other cities I've been to. And the price is right. So it's kind of cool to come down here and get a $3 taco on the run, and I'm looking forward to trying all these places out. Have a good day. A few blocks down Granby Street, these hot dogs set up shop outside TCC. Owner Darnetta Saunders said these trucks and carts are not only satisfying appetites, but filling a need as well. This is convenient. It gives people another opportunity to rush and get something and go head on back to what they're doing. I think it's a really good thing. And something that hits the spot. In Norfolk, Walter Hildebrand, 10 on your side.